first I take my leave of the world and of you. Were you in love with Anne Boleyn? Cardinal Wolsey tells me you were once engaged. Lady Anne is so beautiful, it is the duty of every man to love her. My Lady Anne, you ought to be congratulated for reaching so high. Thank you, Thomas. Love another. Of course, I loved her, but from a distance. No claim on me, Master Wyatt. And since it is so, many still cry aloud, it is a great loss that you are dead and gone. The time you had above your poor degree, the fall whereof your friends may well bemoan, a rotten twig upon so high a tree has slipped your hold and you are dead and gone. My lust, my youth did them depart, and blind desire of ambitious souls, who hastes to climb, seeks to revert, and about the throne the thunder rolls. the same claim as every other lover to whom a woman's heart has been freely given. You are. They flee from me, that sometime did me seek with naked foot stalking in my chamber. I have seen them gentle, tame, and meek, that are now wild. And, and do not remember that sometime they put themselves in danger to take bread at my hand. busily seeking with a continual change. Then I was right. You are leaving me. And will you leave me thus? Say no. Say no. 